tell you a very simple story with a very simple message. And it's one that can empower you to do something that you, in turn, can do to make a difference in the life of maybe just one person. But in doing so, you can change the world. There's someone sitting on their couch wondering how they're going to survive the holidays. They're wondering how they're going to cope without money or with some other personal tragedy in their life. And you're going to bless their lives. You may not even know who it is yet. You may have no idea how their life is going to change because of this simple jar. And I'll tell you the most important lesson I learned that night that I gave this jar away. When I looked in the eyes of my beautiful children, is that the amount of money in the jar doesn't matter. If your jar has $10 or $20 or $30, if it has all you can give, and it's given anonymously, preferably, that's enough. Because when they open their front doorstep, or they find the jar in their cubicle, or in their car, or on a pew at church, they will know that you love them, and that you are aware of them. That is the point of the Christmas jar. It's not about the money, although the money can do a whole lot of good in the right hand. It's about the message. It's about the love that's in the jar, not just the coins. I just want to thank you again and thank this wonderful place for having me. It's not about 2001. It's really about um, the one jar that you guys are going to give to the person that you find um, that is in need, who needs that, that one Christmas jar of hope. She is the reason that we are all here. So Maureen Paisley is right here, and I want to have you guys.